It's me. <laughs> Had a little bit to drink today, so I'm still feeling that gastrointestinal intestinal success. Gaseous intestinal? What is it? Gas? Gaseous intestinal dis intestinal distress. G I G I D. As in get good, get guide. I hope you don't get guide. All right. First time we're checking out the PC. We're gonna move our Pokemon to the Shadow Realm. Goodbye, Scry. Hardly knew ya. Scry was released. Bye, bye, Scry. I'm sorry, my son. I mean, we can always catch another Pidgey or a Pidgeotto if we're in the mood, but we can also skip it. Gives us options. Because if I go to another route and there's a poke the first Pokemon is a Pokemon I've already caught, I don't have to catch it again. So it doesn't force you to have like five Magikarps. Which, you know, could be fine. Are you a trainer? Let's get with it right away. Let's get with it. I think it meant, let's get on with it right away, not let's get with it. Like, that sounds very funky. Yo, <laughs> let's get with it, baby. Mmm. The mirror matchup. Is poison a special attack? I do not think so. Only reason I'm hardening is because I'm hoping Waddle can, like, sweep. This is gonna be the longest gosh dang battle of all time. When you're only Pokemon, or a bunch of cocoons, you know, you're not going to be pumping out a lot of damage. <laughs> Alright, let's see, let's see what we got here. <sighs> one damage. That's looking like, you know, maybe one damage, maybe two damage. Neither of them can get poison too, because they're both poison types. So you already know what, what time it is. It's time to mash that, mash that bay button, baby. Doesn't matter if my speed, my speed is probably at one right now. But it don't matter, baby. Kakunas ain't got legs. Kakunas ain't got legs. Or cocoons for that matter. It's kind of crazy. You think... Cocoons in general are what sparked the idea of, of Pokemon. Because I know, you know, the whole I, the, the theory, quote unquote, of evolution. But you don't, there's no evolution as apparent as bugs when they go from being a weird little caterpillar into a cocoon into a gosh dang butterfly, my dude. Like, how the hell does that happen? They should stick a camera. I know this is probably animal cruelty or bug cruelty. But just theoretically, you should stick a camera inside of the cocoon and see what the heck's going on in there. Also, can we get that crit? It's so, like they're just they just lay there, and it's kind of like reverse birth. You go back into the womb, come out a new man. Imagine that. People would people are thinking like. Oh, that's gross. Reverse, reverse birth. I don't want to climb back in her womb. But if it happened from the very beginning, you would think it's normal. That's that's the problem I have with like censorship and stuff. Is oh, we got that crit. Two damage instead of one. It's like if you try to uncensor everything now, there's gonna be you know maybe a few years of or probably not even a few years, like one year of let's see what we can get away with, you know, and it's gonna be very weird. People are gonna probably try to desensitize their kids, or like extra sensitize their kids by being like, "Oh, you now you can't watch anything." But it's gonna pass, and, and afterwards, you know, it's sort of like there's a, there's this thing in Portugal, I believe. You know, I, I don't I've never been there, but I've heard that all drugs are desensitized there or um, decriminalized there, and because of that, like, you know, I'm sure the first year of Drugs being decriminalized, yeah, there's gonna be a lot of drug use, but it's worth it because people want what they can't have. And in the ongoing years, it's gonna, I'm sure it's gonna go down. Like, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what happened in Portugal. Look at the, the inverse effect. You know, like, back in the day they tried to ban alcohol and people started rioting. It was insane. 
Where am I going with this? Maybe I'm saying that if you do what I'm saying to do, it will start riots, but I don't know. Maybe not. Are people as passionate about alcohol or as passionate about swearing as they are alcohol? I don't know, man. But I'm not talking just swearing. I'm talking like you should be able to show Bob pick on, on TV. Because it's like these kids, they grow up and they're like, the majestic bobs. I must do everything to see those bobs. But if they grow up seeing bobs all the time, they wouldn't care that much. It's the same thing with feet. I'm, you know, there's no scientific research backing this up from my point of view, but I'm sure feet foot fetish comes from. Stop critting me so much. Jesus, Louises. I'm sure foot fetish has come from the fact that feet are kind of like inherently taught to be nasty and the fact that you can't see them all the time they're constantly covered by socks and shoes I'm sure there's something to that no one has a face fetish I mean everybody has a face fetish I, I assume also I'm not putting you guys through this oh sorry Waddle um no one is specifically like oh babe let me see those let me see those that face oh I want to touch her face skin it's like you know what has more attack? I think it's quick attack with 40. I think we checked this last time. Yeah, yeah, yeet. But, it's just like, I don't know, you don't... I, I think, if you made it in verse, where on TV... Oh, jeez, I just burped a little bit. Um, on TV, if you started showing more bobs than feet, I'm sure. You know, again, no scientific research, but I feel it in my heart of hearts. I'm sure the foot fetishes would rise, and the, like, inappropriate groping, or groping, would, would probably lower. I mean, look at it, and this is, this is actually scientifically backed. In Asia, parts of Asia, there's a big, there's big problems with, like, groping in public and, and that kind of stuff. And it's, in my opinion, because they have the highest censorship out of any, you know, compared to the West, at least. Like, they're, they're crazy other censorship over there, and, and yet they have the same problem where there's a lot of public um, sexual harassment and stuff, or sexual assault more so than sexual harassment, I think. I don't know, man. That's just my two cents on the topic that I barely know anything about. It's just, it's just how I feel. You know, I'm, I'm here talking about how I feel, because if I wasn't, I'd be talking to you about how I'm pressing that A button so fast. Kingdom Hearts, all you do in Kingdom Hearts is press X. Yeah, well, have you played uh, freaking Pokemon, bud? Now, there's layers to this. We could have thought more about Pidgey and, and not causing to lose. One of the tips I learned from Nuzlocke was, you know, always, if your Pokemon can get crit, it will get crit. You know, that whole idea. So, if, uh, if he is in a position to get crit, either heal him or switch him out, my dude. Unless you want to lose your boy, and I think, you know, as, as sad as it is, I don't think we valued Scry enough. Would we have let Bulbasaur get that low? I don't know, maybe. You'll have to find out, I suppose, in, in the upcoming episodes. But Surly, Surly seems like he's going to stick around for a while. This guy's pumping out that Deeps. Deeps, for instance, is a uh, is DPS. I don't know where I heard that either. I just, I like it better. If I had new Pokemon, I would've won. Is that a reference to Gen 11, boys? Also, uh... I'm gonna try not to do this every time, but we're gonna hit that, we're gonna hit that heal. As, once our Pokemon get a little bit stronger, we won't have to hit that heal every time. But... It's a bad habit. Maybe it's a good habit, but it is a habit of mine to... Get that free healing in. There's rules to restrict that too, where it's like, you can only use it three times each time, but... I'm not gonna keep a track of that stuff, so. Also, you know, Nuzlocks are hard enough. I've only completed probably like two Nuzlocks in my entire adult career as a superstar. Only. Oh, potions are so expensive. Didn't they lower potions to 200 in the, in the future games? I don't know. I don't remember. Let me know in the comments below if they lowered potions to 200. Alright, who we got next? On this shish kebab crane. Um, 
believe she has like a Jigglypuff. Let's just, you know, let's cut corners. Let's get Surly up in here. The music is banging. Why are you looking at me like that, Sally? You're eight years old. All right, Surly versus Shirley. Was her name Shirley? Surely it wasn't. All right, hit him with those quick attacks. Tail Whip. We'll see about that one, bud. Come on. You cannot crit me. Okay. Hit him with the quick. You know, there's a chance he was going to quick attack us back. Don't talk back, Jack. That didn't level you up. Needle ran. He's got double kick. This is the 100 AQ, 100 AQ, 100 IQ knowledge coming in. Uh, I... I accidentally sent in the wrong guy. But he's got double kick and double kick would absolutely ice our, our poor son. Let's give him one string shot. And you know, we're just going to switch in Bulbasaur. There's nothing Nidoran can really do to Bulbasaur. I wouldn't mind getting a Nidoran. I think Nidoran is cool. I think pretty much every poison type in the game is cool. They just came out with the, the first poison legendary recently. Uh, he's not a legendary, he's an ultra beast? Gosh, don't you know anything? I suppose not. I suppose I do not know anything. So, if he growls us again, we might be doing more damage with Vine Whip, because I believe Vine Whip is a special attack. But, it, it's gonna be, like, neg negligible. I'm sure it's gonna be, like, 2% difference or something like that. I have a question for y'all. Are there any words that you guys like have trouble saying? I've I've gone on video before and I have tr trouble saying uh, reciprocate and like negligible. I think it's just because there's so many vowels or not vowels. Um, what is it called when they're the, the what, when you break up words like um, negligible, reciprocate? You know those those four things. But for, for longer ones, I think it's because my brain, or my mouth is faster than my brain, so my brain can't catch up when the word is too, you know, too many uh, consonants, maybe? Consonants? I don't know. Waddle D. Waddle D. Luffy. Is it, it's level 10 he evolves, right? Please tell me we have like a rare candy or something. I want to hit that. I want to hit that yeet real quick. Okay, these should be, you know, somewhat easy uh, experience. This guy probably has like a rat tat. I think this is Joey, my dude. That's it.